Hey, what is up everyone? This is Ken here. Welcome back again to TechCan YouTube channel. This is a new video about Dot OSV 5.2.1. A new update is arrived for the Redmi Note 8 users, by the way, it's available for some other devices also. But we're going to talk about the Redmi Note 8 users. It's great in the terms of performance. I'm using it for some time. The performance is great. Battery backup seems to be a good one. This is the version Android version 11. It's not Android version 12. But don't worry, it has very interesting features that you will definitely try to use. And I don't think so you'll miss Android. Android 12. Because of this, which is called customizations, a change wallpapers, which is called material theming. I think so it's working. If you are if you ever saw and if you ever used Dot OS, it has the new update with version 5.2, maybe. The previous month we got this update. Some users were saying about the stability issue. There might be some things according to the device, but let me note I didn't got any kind of major issues so far. If you move on to the wallpaper section and here you have some wallpapers for you where you have dot OS walls, lineage OS and other rooms. If you want to try out these wallpapers, you can. Some wallpapers are quite good. By the way, of course, you can use some third party wallpapers, which looks good. You can try installing some apps from the Google Play Store to download and install those wallpapers on a device and wallpaper apply is quite easy. But if you saw that the colors were not changed because as I previously mentioned, it has a monet theming it has let me show you one thing that i've changed this thing this is the color which we have right now if i move on to the settings and move on to the customization section once again now if we move on to this change wallpaper section and click on built-in wallpapers then the color will be changed for example like this if i click on apply click on both and then you will see the color will be changed for you let me just system UI restart for once and then as you can see you are able to see the colors are changed now and yes this is how the look has been changed kind of material theming that looks good of course it's not actual material you which you get in android version 12. it's almost seem like launch year where you have the material theming in android version 11 also which is not exact one but it's good enough and i think so it's good if you compare it with other android version 11 based custom rooms i think so you'll definitely love to try you are eager to try then install this build the link is in the description to install and download of course the installation is quite simple same like other custom rooms so i don't think so i need to show you the installation instructions some interesting things includes the good app opening and app closing speed i think so it's good i'm not saying it's just smoothest ever but it's good it's white smooth and alongside with cool features interesting ui and cool customizations I think so it's good that you have some cool kind of animations with this app opening and app closing which means it's quite smooth enough including the smoothness it also has a very cool interesting features for you for example the google photos unlimited backup yes a lot of users use google photos and you need this unlimited photos backup it's there i don't think so you will definitely use this you will definitely use this by the way let's move on to some benchmark results for example if you're using n22 if you want to use n22 if you want to check out the n22 score 158159 is the score which i'm getting right now as i don't use n22 score and i don't believe on those scores i believe in real performance but some users want to check it out so yes we have including that hey google of course it's working you can see hey google it's working there and if you want to use this thing you can the option is available in the settings and apps section where you can configure the hey google and you'll be able to use the new google assistant looks good of course including that the safety and status also matters a lot i didn't root it my device yet from magisk or wherever the device safety status does not have any kind of issues it's passing you'll be able to use banking apps on a device if you want to i don't think so you'll face any kind of issues in that too now one of the interesting things includes in dot was includes uh, this game dashboard that's also quite improved that's good the ui is interesting game dashboard you can enable from here you can add games manually or if you want to check out the floating windows that looks quite good the quick controls are available here for you for example let me just play this game or let me show you by things the controls which we have for example the screenshot control which is of course working perfectly fine including that you have the screen recording control available for you which you can use while playing games and of course the do not disturb mode and some settings as you just saw where you can enable some options block notifications etc that's quite good in the terms of camera section which also matters a lot minui camera is what you get pre-installed in android version 12 we don't get the minui camera so far but in android version 11 you can use this so minui camera is included if you are a user who always use minui camera then it's there 
Battery backup seems to be decent enough, approximately 10 to 11% of active drain per hour is showing 14%, but yes, of course, we've used 10 to 2 Geekbench, so that's why the stats are something like this, but it's good. If you want to give it a try, link is in the description. This is all, thanks for watching, goodbye. Like I'm floating through the air